Welcome to Admiral's Quarters, Unit 808 in Orange Beach, Alabama. We'll step inside. Three bedrooms, three baths. Notice the towel throughout. The unit is currently not in a rental program and the owner has just refurnished it completely. Let's step out to the best part of all. This is the 08 stack. It's a stunning view. Very much so. From the eighth floor, the way that this balcony is positioned in the building, you can see all the way down to the jetties at Perdido Pass. Notice you've got some shade here in the corner, but you've still got sun too because of the size of this balcony. You've got your outdoor swimming pool and your boardwalk to the beach. And a view of the Four Seasons Fishing Pier. You also have an outdoor storage. I think this is locked up, but it's it's sizable. Yeah, you can store your fishing poles, coolers, Big things like toys. that. Yeah. Okay, tile flooring here, seating for six on the balcony with plenty of room left to entertain and enjoy outside. Let's step back in and we'll go over the details. Yeah, let's go back in where it's nice and cool. Okay, so. That door is gliding so smoothly. It's been well maintained. <clears throat> so it's a brand new furniture package. We have details on um, price points and where the decor is from. I know Maloof Maloof has a few in pieces in the condo. Right, and the leather uh, ottoman here. This is all brand new from Maloof Furniture and Foley. Uh, Sleeper sofa, brand new. I'm not sure anybody's even slept on that sleeper sofa yet. These are chairs from Bassett, the, the Pippa style. Uh, you can tell there's not even, you get close to the chairs there and see that they, they look like as if they've not even been sat on. New rug underneath, a Sissel style rug. Um, we have blackout window treatments all along the windows facing the Gulf. Yes, they're flat fold blackout shades made by Smith and Noble. Okay. Let's talk about the mattresses too in the bedrooms here. Let's walk into the master. So you have balcony access from the master bedroom and it's furnished with a king size bed. Mm -hmm. It's a Sealy Posturepedic new. Hybrid. All the mattresses are from Sealy Posture Feeding. New lamps. Right. Yes. New carpet. Yeah, this is a Sissel style carpet here. All the, the bedding in the master here too is from Pinecone, which is, as some of you may know, is a nice high end linen uh, company. I've seen it in some of the nice designer boutiques that we have here in Orange Beach, you know, at the wharf and uh, on Canal Road too. The Black mask. Screen. Oh, I'm sorry. No, it's okay. No, it's okay. Black screen TV. Turn it around here so you can see. Okay. So the master bath. Yeah. Step in here. You've got the double sink, vanity, tile flooring. Right. New carpet there in the closet there. Same carpet as in the bedrooms. I believe to Renee, correct me, I, I think all Adam's floors have the separate tub and shower. Um, so you got to take a good look at that there. Stand up shower here with the tile wall around it and the oversized jacuzzi tub. 
Yeah. In the master bath. You know, there's a nice little cheap bath accent table there too. All of this stays, by the way, there are two furniture exceptions noted in the MLS, but otherwise everything stays. The unit will convey as you see it in this video. All furnishings, accessories, appliances, down to the silverware. That's right. That view is just stunning. You can actually lay here in the morning in the master bed, and this would be your view. Unbelievable. Oh, wow. <laughs> nice view to wake up to, isn't it? Very much so. So then we'll come back in here um, in the living area, and just off to the side is your wet bar. You have the sink and the ice maker. Let's see. I believe we still have it. Yes, it's a new line. Ice maker, of course, it's turned off because the unit's vacant and it's not being rented. It's uh, in pristine condition, y'all. Um, new paint on the walls and the ceiling. Seating in the dining room for six. And two bar stools at the kitchen counter. I love Admiral's Porter's Kitchen, don't you? I do too. It, it's so spacious and open. And one of my favorite things about Admiral's Quarters is this island setting here in the kitchen. You can actually have several adults in the kitchen cooking and preparing at the same time. Friends standing around the counter. So you've got plenty of cabinet and counter space. Yeah, you can hear the door. The drawers gliding, self-closing. Hey, nobody cooks at the beach, but if you want to. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see, um, let me open the cabinets here and you can just kind of get a feel of how the owners have the kitchen stocked. Um, because it is a three bedroom, three bath with a sleeper sofa, the unit will sleep and accommodate eight. Yeah. So um, again, everything that you see in this video will convey with the cell. And um, let me open the cabinets down here so you can see also what is stopped. Again, plenty of cabinet space. Yeah, you can see why people can live here full time, and you can also see why that makes such a wonderful beach rental. Admiral's quarters, um, the three bedroom units, will generate a substantial rental income. You've got an owner's storage closet here where if you did want to rent it, you could lock your own personal items that you wanted to leave behind. It's locked. Yeah, we've got it secured now, but you can see how large it is. And then in this closet here is the linen closet. You've got washer and dryer, hot water heater. It's, a, it's an ample size laundry and utility closet. Right, and if owners, you know, owners can have pets here. Uh, you know, so this even this laundry room is even big enough to store a pet freight if someone wanted to. Perfect. And then back toward the north side of the unit, you have your two guest bedrooms. And this bedroom here, um, again, new carpets, have plantation shutters. Yeah, the bedding too, this brand new bedding, uh, very high quality. Uh, the, the sellers were contemplating keeping this unit a while longer. Uh, lifestyle changes and then they had property at another location actually at another town another state but uh, the bedding is pristine actually if I rented it out I would probably hide this bedding and keep it lock so. it in the owner's closet right and yeah. just off of this guest bedroom is a private bath so you have a vanity there uh, your bath and shower tile, new carpet throughout the closet area.
Yeah, almost every stick of furniture in here is new except for the, the dining room table and chairs and I think the bureau under the mirror. Which is in like new condition. Mm -hmm. And then off of the hallway on this side is another guest bedroom and this is the north side plantation shutters also Let's with see. a blackout shade behind it let's check out the view though you've got a nice north view uh, of cotton bayou this here we go it gets a peek at it anyway this is really long so you've got the tv here, here accessories okay and the view off of the north side you can see cotton bayou yeah eighth floor is a great floor for optimal views not too high but high enough you've got the closet here and then just off of this bedroom is the guest bathroom the way that they have designed the doors if you wanted to make this a private bathroom to this second bedroom you certainly could <clears throat> lock this door off and just have it accessible to only the guest in that bathroom sorry guest in that bedroom All of the accessory rugs throughout the condo are new. The sellers have done an excellent job. It's in pristine condition. Yeah, there's and nothing, I mean, you can look at them and say there's no zero layer on here. And, uh, that comes with a non-rental unit, um, the zero wear and tear that is being mentioned. And then here is another storage closet inside, beach chairs, kites, things like that. Just inside that door. Okay. So we can, we'll go and uh, show the amenities next. So I just want to stand over here in the corner and pan around for you one more time so that you can get another view. Um, the exterior balcony here. And then here we go. It's open, it's spacious, it feels crisp and clean. The decor is high end, it just feels nice. It's in, I mean, the condition is just amazing. And the fees are not bad either, they're 686 a month for this 1600, almost, almost 1700 square foot unit. So the HOA fees cover the insurance on the building. The owner is responsible for content and liability insurance. And the HOA fee also covers the upkeep on the grounds, maintenance on the building, and the amenities package is what the HOA fee covers. It also covers the association management fee and this HOA is managed by the CASA. Yes, they recently took over from the former Kaiser. Some of you out there may have been familiar with Kaiser management. Uh, they are now uh, part, part of the Vacasa network. <clears throat> if you have any questions about the unit, uh, we are just finishing up inside. We're gonna go down and film the amenities so that everyone can see that. But if you have any questions, please feel free to reach out to your real estate agent. If you do not have a real estate agent, we'd love to work with you and help you purchase this beautiful condo in Orange Beach. You guys take care and be safe.